Hello, you are welcome to my channel. My name is Ellie the Blogger. Thanks for clicking to watch this particular video. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit the notification bell to be the first to watch any video that I post. Today, what are we going to be talking about? We are going to be talking about what happened over the weekend concerning the comments of the former president John Dramani Mahama about the Achim Sakawa boys. <laughs> the Achim Sakawa boys. You know, some people are of the view that he should apologize for endorsing that comment that was actually posted by a certain member of parliament, which is on the side of the minority in parliament. You know, some people are also of the view that when the current president was also an opposition leader, at the time when the ex-president, the late Ivan Satanos was the sitting president at the time, they also called him so many, you know, names and stuff, attacking his personality and stuff. So there is no need for him to apologize because what he did to a certain member sorry a certain president at the time has also been done to him that's what some people are also saying let me know what you also think in the comment section below come to think of it the question is that i ask myself concerning this whole hula balloon is what actually brought this whole achim sakawa thing Then the Japa comes to mind. So today it seems as if when you listen to the trend now, the attention is being moved from the bread and butter issue, which is a Japa deal, whether it's good or bad. Now the attention has been shifted to what someone has said concerning the Achims or a particular group of people who are who they claim to be milking the state in terms of this Asia party yeah fine what the president uh, the ex-president said in a way we could say is too harsh you know it's too harsh fine but the most important thing or the most important issue of this matter is a Japadi. that some people want to run away from. Fine, what the uh, ex-president said was, was not good, fine. Let's move away from that. Let's concentrate on the deal. The reason, what the issue that brought, that brought this uh, Achim Sakawa thing, we should look into the issue, which is the Japan deal, whether it's good or bad. So that we know that, okay, the, the deal we are talking about it's okay. I don't understand the reason why just one deal, the whole country is almost disagreeing with a particular deal, but still the government wants to push this agenda. But they claim that this deal is for the betterment of the country. You are doing something for the people, and at the end of the day, the people are opposing what you, you claim to be good for them. That should send you a signal that either the people do not understand your good intention or your intention might be wrong. So personally, I will plead that let's look into this deal, will benefit the country or not. And let's stop redirection attention to a particular thing that do not personally do not make sense to me whether the president former president apologizes or he doesn't apologizes the deal still stands we need to look into this deal whether it will benefit the country or not this is the most important thing and not we say we say no at the end of the day when we leave this a japan deal and fight each other over a particular comment 
these same people are going to pass pass behind us and do what they want to do these diversion tactics will not work this time around yes somebody has said something that does not make sense or it's not good fine let's condemn it and move forward and dig into the deal whether it's good or not this is what i have to say if you have anything to say drop it in the comment section below but before you drop any comment in the comment section below do not forget to subscribe to this channel share this video like hit the notification bell let's build a community together to push mother ghana thanks for watching this video i'm out